This is Deductor, continuing to pit play through with the Striker on hard, getting ready to go down to floor 24. Just reviewing the situation, the run is still in quite a quite a challenging state. Food supplies are low, unless I find a bunch of Tarka Warbread, um, or unless I unlock uh, Metabolic Control, which I am not that far away from. If I can get Metabolic Control, I'll be okay. Uh, unfortunately, though, my weapons are not that great. I've yet to find something better than a laser carbine or scatter gun, and having a better weapon would be incredibly helpful. But for now, we have no choice but to press on. Floor 24. What do we got here? One of these robots, the mediums. Oh! Thank you, game, for letting me turn without spinning a move. That thing! Right below me, the dreaded Night Saber um, from my Ranger Hard series. Uh, that enemy is one of the most terrifying in the game against a lowly armored uh, creature such as myself. This is what I'm going to do. I'm going to try to fear it. If I can fear the cat, I'll be fine. If I can't fear the cat, I have no choice but to use a mother egg on that robot. So, let us... Uh, Begin the fear. Yes, that's what all the investment in power does. Allows us to fear much more reliably. The armor is not going to really help us against the robot, so I will unequip it, and then let's just start shooting the robot. Appears to be derping out, which is great. Yes, little robot, derp, derp. Wow, I don't know why that robot is derping this much. I know, like, I put the, the, uh, I think, bio mod that reduces attack chance in here. Yeah, but that's still a lot of derping by the robot. Look at that. Incredible stuff. We'll try to... Whoa. Okay, Fist. And I want to watch this robot very carefully to make sure it's feared at all times. Yeah, there we go. Still feared. I'm just gonna hit it with my maybe not the biggest gun, but one of the bigger guns I have. Heavy pistol. Hmm. Why am I so inaccurate with it? Looks like the fear has worn off. Yes. Okay, now that it's bleeding, perhaps we can go ahead and mm, we'll use the target pistol. There we go. Okay. Phew! That enemy terrified me. Those things could do absurd amounts of damage. Like without armor, they can do like. 180 close to 200 around or something like that. Purifier, that's a great find. That is going to help stretch out my food. I have plenty of stuff to purify, including some of this moldy bread. That's 20 extra food per bread. That's a lot of food. Let us toss some stuff that I don't really need. I mean, electronic toolkits are nice. But I do, do I really need two of them? The answer is probably no. I mean, it's not that big of a deal. The biggest thing they help with are repair stations and tesseract wells, and I already have one anyway. Uh, let's ID that serum. Psionic overload, that's no good. You don't want that. Eat the fungi bar. And pick back up the mother egg. Increase speed. Now that is a trap I want. I'd be very careful here, especially without a level up heal. Alright, it's a strangler, and this uh, storage room looks very promising. Oh, I could have killed it in one hit. Ah, Redactoro.
repair the console for some extra experience. I can kill the Redactor whenever. Uh, does not appear to have Psy Shield at. Well, I can't really tell. Or just TK Fist it. Come on, big food, big food! No! That is not a large amount of food. I think I actually have 10 of these exotic proteins. Master Kit, that's good. I can restore Psy. But I'm running out of slots to throw away. I still need a cyber connector, I guess. This item, the terror bomb, ugh. Maybe we find a tesseract well. Oh god, that is the sound of a Morigi Heavy. Morigi Heavy drone. One of the most dangerous robots. Yeah, I kind of need that repair station. Oh boy. I'll let the uh, Morigi drone bust down the door for me. Well, didn't give me that. Okay, I backed up so that the mother egg would only control the Morigi heavy. Yes, go Morigi drone. Kill! Ah, another laser carbine, that's perfect. Uh, okay, that makes me want to use my... What grenades do I have? The EMP? No, I don't want to use that. Better reload this. Oh, there's some other enemy that's unseen, but... I think it just killed a bear of some sort. Wow, this drone is just doing like all the work for me. Let's move up one more. Okay. Uh, let's hit it with the laser carbine to make sure it dies. How dare you? Oh, it's a second Marugi Heavy. Okay, that's good. Kill that. And then I'm going to use the um TK Fist, and when that didn't quite get the job done, let's finish it here with Heavy Pistol. This uh, Makose Cluster can't really do enough damage to me for me to care. This particular robot is not derping out this Medium War 3. Wow. Good for you, little robot. There we go. There we go. Unforgivable. Still haven't fixed the down key on my keyboard. Should really get on that. Oh boy, necrotic horror. It's doubtful I can fear it. Oh boy. What's my strength at again? I have uh, two skill points left, huh? A little bit extra foraging can't hurt. Why investing biotech? Um, maybe like lockpick or something, or save the point. A computer that could be good. Okay, necrotic horror, necrotic horror. Probably immune to fear. I'll paralyze it. Is it immune to paralysis? <laughs> Damn thing could be immune to paralysis. Don't exactly have like the most instant healing. Better start shooting this enemy. Then a TK fist. There we go, that's better. Even if we tried to mob on the robot, eh, kind of worked. That cost me a lot of health, but the mother egg control in that Mariki Heavy was priceless. Just gonna chuck one of the empty laser carbine 
pick up the fresh one. It's a really good find. Ooh, we have a recombination center and cyber connectors. I actually need the cyber connectors. Two repairs. Beautiful. Guess we can put one more point into computer just to pump that skill a little bit higher. Get that repair chance up a bit. Mob is the obvious first one and the padded armor, of course. Ideally, I would use a living steel patch to repair the padded armor, but you can't always get uh, what you want. Put back on the armor. We can use up this last magic charge. We could use recombination center. Guess I have some items I could chuck in there. I'll chuck the quantum capacitors. Whoa, floor targeting? Ah, we don't want that. Uh, don't need that. Don't need all these extra, like, cybernetic brain or electronic parts. Um, don't really need two living steel remnants. A logic circuit? That's useless. Okay, we're gonna feed the logic circuit back in. Uh, I guess I could just use like another electronic part, but you can put in another item to uh, prevent that item from being rolled. So like if you have a logic circuit in here, it'll never roll out a logic circuit. Since I have so many of these uh, uh, exotic proteins, and it didn't work anyway. So all that was really for naught, but now I have cyber connectors and I can make uh, adamantium claws if I find a lab. Claws aren't uber on the striker, but they're still really good. I would still make them if only to absorb armor damage, but that is hardly their main purpose. They do do good damage on the striker. It's about a laser carbine level of damage. So well worth it. Swarm of robots incoming soon, but that's okay. Looks like there's an armory down there. Robots should be coming from the southern direction soon enough. There we go. Boy, more of these medium security bots, huh? They wreck armor, but who knows what else is coming. Boy, healing is a huge problem. I'm gonna equip my Marigi drone. Tonic amplifiers. Ugh. Okay. Okay, go away, little, uh, little living brain. I must spread. My this might be a good time to use a master kit charger too. Yeah, that's great. Okay, the living brain is coming back to repair this turret. Can't have that. Maybe I should just kill the living brain. It can't drop anything good, but it can summon ads that drop good stuff. I would try to conserve the energy cells as much as possible, but it's not really giving me many choices in terms of the weapons to use except the scatter gun. I know what I can do. This armor is better saved for other stuff. Yeah, this summons two Havoc drones. If you do enough damage, eventually, like, more robots will show up. Ah, perfect. Okay, now we can try to use the scatter gun on these three, and the two Havoc drones don't do enough damage to be... Well, let's do this. This way I hit three enemies. Oh boy.
I need energy cells. Come on, little robot. No such luck. Not good. I can feel the Healing situation is critical. Ammo situation is pretty bad. Food situation is pretty bad. How am I going to survive this? I need every ounce of cunning. But it, will that be enough? I don't know. God, is that a revenant? Those things can fear, and how many humgums do I have? Decent amount? Ugh. I guess I could have targeted a better spot, but I, I'm terrified of that fear. I'm not using the scattergun that efficiently, but. Oh boy. Yeti. Oh god. Nasty stuff. Okay. At least I've had my mob fully repaired. Without armor, the Yeti is incredibly brutal. Oh, there's a goddamn mastermind in this room. It's worth it to try to exit. So that I can at least paralyze him. So this could, like, I could actually win. <laughs> Raw meat? That's really good. Oh god, a maintenance master? What is wrong with this game? Need some health. Okay, the maintenance master does not appear to be coming up for whatever reason. I'll take that to do as much damage to the Yeti as possible. Okay, now I've aggroed it. I have no choice. Now I'll need to equip the squawker drone. So nasty. Okay, that master kit charge work, that's really good. I have to interrupt the Mariki Medro to do this, but what choice do I have? Okay. Probably worth using the scatter gun here because that stupid Yeti can do so much damage. Okay, that's good. And I might use the scatter gun again if like the cards align. Nope. No, you can't steal that med kit, buddy. I need that med kit. Did I side drain this? I think I did. But it still had more side for me to drain. Oh, thank you, thank you. Pungent meat and the stone crab. That is absolutely delicious stuff. Absolutely delicious. That's a hundred food. That's gonna save me. I am ready. Strike. Okay, pick my improvised medkit back up. Just don't have room to carry a lot of these items. Alright, the mastermind. I will attempt to manipulate. Mostly for the drones that will spawn. That will give me, hopefully, uh, some more energy cells. If a robot were to come, that would be fine. Uh. 
Kose. Drop food. Also awesome. Robots are coming. And so is my level up here. Okay, there's one robot. Let it get close. Use another master kit charge. Ugh, didn't work. Use another one. Good. Heal up. Watch over me. No drops, but that's all right. Behind every action, there is a thought. D desk, less good. 63% into this tactical database. That's pretty good. Tactics vs. Maintenance Master improved. Excellent. And I passed again. Tactic against Revenants. Two very irritating enemies. I'm gonna go back down this hallway. Like this. There are some more rooms in the south I would like to explore. For the um, armory. First, we'll lock and close the door. Nip oh, God. Skunk ape. Why? Why did it have to be a skunk ape? It's as good a time as any to use a side booster. Well, try to land the fear. Okay, good. Do I even have to kill it? The sad answer is probably. Great. It's just gonna cost me so much ammunition. Oh right, it's 20 or 5 uh, Psy now. They can drop living steel patches, which are very valuable for me. I can basically keep my armor on all the time. Yes! Living Steel Patch! Okay! That was worth it then. Not that I could have known ahead of time, but there's an adaptoid if you've ever seen one. I need an elixir. Actually, might as well level now for the side boost. And because I just want to keep going. Oh, plus one to redaction? You gotta be kidding. Ah. Uh. That a revenant? Giant mitochondria is really good. I need to make some space though. Also see what's in Oh two of these hivers. I'm gonna have to think about that room then. It's not so easy to beat two of them when I have very limited ammunition. Could be a uh, mine wolf. Yep. Honestly, the mind wolf doesn't hurt that much. Revenant, eh? Can they open doors? I'm not sure they can open doors. Poison? That's not good. This on the mine wolf. Claws on the wolf. Tainted meat. Delicious. Pineal gland. Useful, but I'm running so low on inventory space right now.
guess I could eat the Nova fruit. It's useful to resist cold. So when you have, well, given this, given my armor situation, I better keep the Nova fruit. You never know. You never know when it may come in handy. Okay, we'll keep that. What about like eating the egg by itself? That's not necessarily bad, but with the purifier, you can make star bacon, and bacon and eggs is, is pretty good food. A lot of these other items are too useful to discard. If I were to discard any one of my utility items, it would probably be the squawker drone. But even that has its uses. Man, I am actually really out of things to discard right now. Except like my spare laser carbine. Don't want to be doing that. some more bypass circuits so I don't want to quite be discarding my cybernetic brain just yet teleport bombs are so useful painkillers could save me digital interpreter it's actually not that crazy. I don't need recipes. And this really only helps getting into Tesseract Wells. But it also helps with ammo crates. Yeah, and that's such a good source of energy cells. Okay, can't ditch that. Can't ditch that. I guess it's gotta be the Squawker Drone. Alright, Squawker Drone, you served me faithfully. But from now on, if there's an uh, enemy like the Maintenance Master, I'm going to have to think up a new way of dealing with it. That lab station is also gonna be huge. Two lab stations. Even better. You are mine. I am ready. Let's try again. You've ruined my Alright. Come on, little. I'm bleeding. Fine, wolf. <laughs> Thank you, labs. Ooh. From the doctor. Impressive. Doesn't seem to see me. You can sneak up on them. Real quiet like. When you're like when you're a dragon and you manage to sneak up on a creature, I think that should be an accomplishment in itself. I can actually have a decent chance of repairing this damaged neuro enhancer. Ugh. No such luck. Immuno Jolt, that's not really that great. Alright. First things first. Two X bypass circuits. Next, let us attempt the Adamantium Claws craft. It's 46%. Okay, attempt one. Here goes nothing. I have two attempts. Okay, that's alright. Is there any way for me to boost my strength? I should have thought of that first. Not really. I don't really want to put points into Mechanico be because besides crafting adamantium claws, it's not really that important for the Marigi. I am huh, why can't I, uh... Oh, because I need one more cyber connectors. Ah, yes, yes. Should definitely craft one energy backpack. And I guess I have no other use for these cyber brains, so... Um... Oh, I gotta pick up my energy backpack too. It's actually really bad to be so fooding efficient right now. Then I can go back and pick up my squawker drone. Hooray! Hungry. Might as well eat one of the hybrid cheese. I'm gonna go back to check out that room anyway. Uh, I can't spare the food. 
Alright, I also need to drop my other ammunition types to try to get more energy cells. Energy cells are life. No such luck, but I get flashé rounds. Those are really good too. Duct tape, that could come in handy. 80 flashé rounds. Good stuff. I'll take that. Looks like I will be picking up the squawker drone after all. Okay, I'm gonna put on my Marigi Protection RA. It should provide in conjunction with Psy Armor. Decent protection! I'm gonna actually fear that one. There's a weapon locker in here. I feel like I have to take this room. And these weapons have such high penetration, even the Murgi Protection Array isn't, like, that great against it. Okay, it's wounded. I can focus down the other one. like it's just a weapons locker. I was hoping there'd be something else in this room too. Oh, you gotta be kidding. KO grenades? That's not even really worth the time to go pick it up. I need better weapons than that. You never know. Those can drop like a sword. A sword would be huge for me right now. I, I think it was worth the risk. Exit, I suppose, could be here. Oh god, how horrifying that would be. Tesseract well, that's good. But let me try to... God, the Protean, Corrupted Doctor... Uh, I do want this room. You surrender to fear. Worth it? F to hit two targets? Maybe not two targets, but I know what I can do. Tear your mind apart. It's okay to be knocked unconscious. There are no range enemies until the Tarka showed up. Every action there is no! Thought. Bad Tarka, how could you heal that fast? Ugh. Bad Tarka. White. Bad. Unless you drop Tarka Warbread, then you're the best Tarka ever. Eh, rifle rounds. I don't even think I have space for that. Oh well. Yes, now! Scattergun, do your thing! Hitting three enemies like that, so efficient. And it dropped a Terran medkit. Excellent. good opportunity then for me to use up my improvised medkit. I think, yeah, that uh, perfected clone is running. I have you now. Hmm. I could TK fist the Protean. And then use another, like, scattergun burst on the two proteans that spawn. It's not a bad idea. Once I get metabolic control, everything will be better. The promised land. Metabolic control, alright. Let's just go ahead and TK fist that one. And then use the scattergun here. Uh, two of the proteans scattered. Base pace is assisting me. The one wonders how much longer that could last. Can I one shot these? Yes. Okay, not 
quite perfect one shot. This one's wounded, so let's try to finish off Die. one farther away. Then I'm going to shoot the uh, little hiver. Damn you, hiver. Alright, these blister lizards can permanently damage armor. So I'm going to unequip my armor and then fear it. Ouch. Why did it attack me? How did it attack me when feared? Ow. What is this sorcery? Are they immune to fear? Okay, not quite sure what happened there. Maybe there's some special behavior. Uh, if it's an uh, enemy that no, but other enemies that don't leave the room when they're feared, they just like leave the room. I don't know why this blister lizard behaves like this. Omni gland could have uses. Turn med kit. Try to use up the improvised med kit. Hungry again. Oh boy. Painkillers could come in handy. Lab. Uh. If I make a second energy backpack, I'll be down to my last seven energy cells still. It's probably a good idea. Even the apes are looking delicious. And I'll have to be extremely careful with my last seven energy cells. Ugh. Logic circuits don't need those. I doubt this is an adaptoid because I would have heard something during the fighting. Tesseract well is well worth using everything on to try to open Indeed. or repair. Um, 85%, that's pretty good. Alright. We have pistol rounds, which is good. I can make a duck cape armor. In fact, I can do that right now. I think that is a very good idea to attempt this right this moment. Uh, if I find another cyber connector, I can attempt the uh, adamantium claws again. I feel almost like I need to be storing some items here. I don't need a padded armor if I make the duct tape armor. I can store some of my bypass circuits. I have too many anyway. I could easily find cyber connectors in one of the remaining rooms. Um, let's, what food do I have stored? Zoo fuel rations and two bread. Guess I can take out the bread and eat them. I think I was saving it for like ribs or something, but or like an avian carcass. Eh, guess I might still be worth saving. But I'm fast like running out of food I want to eat. Nah, let's just eat the bread. I could attempt to make a faux tag, but I just don't have any room to store these items. Hmm. Like, I feel like I kind of need everything else. Like including a full stack of pistol ammunition. <laughs> you 
Yeah, this looks good. This looks like what I gotta do. RG special. I can keep this equipped at all times. Which will surely help. Human. Ah! How dare you! All right, little human. Can I side rein you? I tear yes. Thank you, little human. No grenades, but that's all right. Watch over me, ancestors. Ah, uh, the exit may very well be at the slave pen. That's that's horrible. Please let the exit be here. Yes, okay, it's nine to slave pen. As long as nine to slave pen, I'm happy. Sludgeling. Can't those like do high level disease or something? I can kill that Makose soon. It'll come back. We're fill filling that out. Yeah, it'll come this way. Okay. Come on, Makose. No worries. I'll unlock the lockers first. Yo <gasps> Tesseract! Pocket Tesseract! That solves all of my inventory problems. Thank you, game. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, I mean, I was just happy to be able to finally kill this Makose. Okay, let me backtrack a bit. Finally kill this Makose. No food drop. I would have been happy if I got like one fungo meat. I didn't get that. And I got a coding avatar and pocket tesseract. Boy, if I can find food or get to metabolic control, I'll be in okay shape. These are two very useful finds. They're like not useful immediately. But if I can stabilize my food situation, um, and I'm saving the hero sausage because I want to duplicate it if at all possible, um, I guess next thing I would do is I would actually start converting the moldy bread and the star bacon to, you know, more efficient types of food. But yeah, that was uh, that was huge. Uh, should heal up a bit before I go down. Use like two of the making charges. Yeah, that's good. Okay, it's pretty good floor. Amazing final room. <laughs> this uh, this is um, cryo lab. Usually not known for its drops, but this has got to be one of the best cryo labs in history. Coding avatar, one of the best items in the game, and pocket tesseract, also one of the best items in the game. So thank you for watching. Until next time.